Hello! If you've ever tried to create a worksheet for students to fill out in Google Docs, you've probably fallen subject to the creation of lines for students to enter information into. What I mean by this is you place the request for information at the start of a line, followed by a series of underscores. What typically happens then is a student tries to type in the line, like this, which just pushes the line away, often messing up further formatting in the page and leaving the information floating between underscores. Instead, I'm going to show you how to create neat and tidy text boxes in Docs, where students can enter the information you have requested. The trick to this is applying tables in Google Docs. So for this example, let's choose a 2 by one table. Resize the first cell until it fits neatly around the question text. Next, click on the small arrow in the upper right-hand corner of the cell. This allows you to select what kind of border you would like, and I want you to click here, which will create an outer border. Next, head to this menu up here, where you can specify line thickness and set the border width to zero. We're almost there, but you'll notice that we've lost this border here, so select the drop-down menu from the cell where you want the answer to go. Select the outer border once again and head back to the line thickness menu. However, this time, we'll select a thickness of one. You can also use this trick if you want to place a larger box under a larger question. In that case, I typically type out the question, then hit enter to move to the next line. Now I just create a one by one table and don't need to do any additional formatting except resizing the box to the appropriate size for the students to enter their answers into. Hopefully you found this helpful. If you have any questions, please let us know in the comments section below. Thanks for watching, and have a great day.